Greetings, Derek DeBross from Munitions Law Group, munitionsgroup.com. Please follow us on uh, social media and click that notification button below. I'm going to get right to the question today. It's a very short question, and it's more of an opinion question. As a lawyer, what's your stance on constitutional carry? Constitutional carry, of course, uh, what they're referring to is unlicensed concealed carry, I guess is another way of saying it. Just uh, the Constitution is my, my license, is what they oftentimes say, right? Um, Look, I'm all, I, I am borderline anarcho-capitalist, so government regulation, I'm not a big fan of it. I make my living off government regulation, of course, uh, but constitutional carry, I'm all for it. Uh, a lot of people in the concealed carry movement don't like it because they think you should have to get training. Uh, I'm under the firm belief that I think the training apparatus built into the law is it's kind of a it's a false positive in a, in a person's mind a lot of, especially new gun owners like if you're a new gun owner and the state's saying well if you do this eight hour class you're going to be safe enough to carry a gun and we're going to license you so then they think well i don't need any more training the state said i'm good enough i'm good to go and that's furthest thing from the, the truth. I still train to this day. I'm a combat veteran. I've been training for the last 20 years of my life and I continue to do it. I'm actually gonna be taking a CQB course this weekend. Uh, so I am fully in support of constitutional carry. I, I, I honestly would, would venture to even say that you know having a licensing scheme that requires training can actually have a negative effect on the overall concealed carry culture because it might create this this mindset that you don't need any further training. You've done enough, right? You're safe enough to carry the gun. The state has said so. Uh, now, there's plenty of people that disagree. I'm sure I'm gonna get all kinds of comments. Please just make fun of my red hair, you know, or my outfit or whatever it is, or the TV on the screen. I had one guy make fun of my computer printer once, so <laughs> please drop the comments. I enjoy reading them. Uh, but with that said, I hope that it gives you some insight into how my mindset works on that issue. And uh, with that said, be safe and carry on.